Hey YouTube, what's up? Um, this is Paul here, broadcasting from Tokyo, Japan. Um, I never thought I'd say this, but uh, welcome to my new YouTube project for 2020. You're probably here because you either like Japan or photography or both. And I hope to share my stories, my experiences in both areas. Today I thought I'd just make this quick, short video um, and give you an overview of what this channel will be about. Now instead of just talking to you, I thought I'd talk to you and show you. So here we go. This is my home work space. So this, all this stuff is basically a blueprint of um, 2020. By putting everything into one space, like, just compressed like this, it, it's basically a, a mirror. It's a reflection of what it's like to live in Japan uh, or live in, to, in Tokyo, especially. Um, it's very tight. It's very, you know, space is limited. Here is my uh, daily planner, okay? And um, I keep all my, my photos in here, um, personal stuff, people close to me. Um, these are projects that I've done, I've worked on in the past. It is beautiful. It is beautiful. And I got a new page for 2020. Uh, this is a cityscape uh, project, which I shot mainly with uh, this machina right here. And these are the contact sheets. This is a series about suicide. Yeah, it's sad. And this is a project that I'm working on now. Here, one of my projects that I'm working on right now. So I gotta get used to this damn vlogging thing but there is my print which I'll just show it to you it's hanging and uh, I have an exhibition coming up in April in Tokyo so uh, if you're in around drop by more info later by the way okay my gear my toys um, I shoot mainly with this Machina 6.7 and when I do shoot medium format I usually use um, Kodak tracks great film 
I also like to shoot 35 millimeter. Um, I use mainly that uh, that Nikon 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 F. I also like to use um, these East German cameras because I like the design and they're quite funky. And if I do shoot in 35 millimeter, I like to use Orvo film, which is also from well East Germany. This year I would like to shoot more um, 8 millimeter. I shoot Super 8 as well, but this is regular 8. So here's my Bolex, and here's the film for that. FOMA. Now I like to print my photos. I don't have a scanner. I had one, I sold it, um, but I print a lot. I have a dedicated darkroom, uh, but when I get lazy, I like to print at home. So this is this desk is actually the baseboard of my enlarger, and here is my enlarger. Okay, so it doubles as my desk. And this desk light here, which I got from IKEA, is basically also my safe light. So I just take this little red doodad film, or red film, just put it over there, and it turns into my safe light. But you can't really see it so much. Trust me, the room is red. Okay. In, in this channel, I hope to introduce you to people that I encounter through my projects or just people around me. Um, and one really interesting person that I met was uh, Mr. Uchida Yasuo. And I interviewed him about five years ago. And basically he is or was the chief designer of this camera. So I thought it was pretty amazing to meet the guy who made this and take his portrait. And by the way, these are my um, some of my uh, memory cards, my CF cards, SD cards. I do shoot digital. That's it. Chin down, chin down. More, 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 more. That's the one. Look to me. So I'm not one of those digital haters. So yeah, I shoot digital as well. And finally, through this channel, I hope to introduce you to um, parts of Japan which you've probably never heard of. And so this for this book here, it's a great book, it's in Japanese. It's a, basically a guidebook to like dirty, grungy areas of Tokyo. That's what this channel is going to be about. It's going to be about Japan, life in Japan, life in Japan behind the camera, analog photography, uh, darkroom work, digital photography, photography in general. So if you're interested, Please subscribe, hit the notification button, and see you in future videos. Bye for now.